Hey guys, it's the Dutch Farm Master and welcome to the first part of this brand new Let's Build. So today I'm in San Marcino in the Sims for City Living and I'm building a nightclub because that's what was requested a lot. I asked all of you what you wanted to see me build in the Sims for City Living and a nightclub slash restaurant was something that popped up a lot so I decided, you know, I thought it was a really good idea, so I thought I'm going into the more, most luxurious area of The Sims 4 uh, City Living uh, World Semi-Tuna, which is called Uptown, I believe. And um, yeah, from here you've got insane views over the city. And uh, this was a skyscraper which I hadn't built anything on top of yet, because this is a penthouse. Uh, yeah, so yeah, it's just a nightclub on top. Of a skyscraper which is absolutely really really cool in my opinion I've never been to a nightclub which is on top of a skyscraper myself but I can imagine that it would be pretty cool I'm not sure if there is actually a nightclub on top of a skyscraper somewhere in the world I do know about a really cool rooftop bar uh, in Bangkok which um, I see a lot of pictures of and I know a couple of people who've been there and that looks really fancy and really cool uh, but this place really inspires me, this part of Samachuna really inspires me of Hong Kong. So I sort of imagine this as a nightclub in Hong Kong, which is like a very, it might sound if you've never been there, like a, like a typical Asian city, but it is quite Western-like for uh, an Asian city. I've been there and it's a really a cool city. So that's kind of what it's inspired by. Uh, but yeah, this is a let's build, but I have decided to speed it up a little bit because otherwise, um, if I don't speed it up and I'm talking and at the same time building, it often just takes way too long before I finish the let's build. And also I notice that the uh, end result doesn't look as good if I uh, do it in that way. So I thought, you know, I'm just going to first record uh, several parts of the building process or just start building and then afterwards divide it up into several parts and talk about it. And in that way, yeah, we still have a let's build and I do actually have uh, time or I can actually take your requests into consideration I think but not in the next part already because I've recorded that but um, yeah just put any request you've got in the uh, comments down below and then maybe I can actually at the end make one episode in which I add all the changes which I think are a good idea or something like that but um, many of the episodes will be pre-recorded as well uh, it will be a six part series I do know that already because that's sort of what I estimated to be I was like hmm how long will it be and I think it will be six parts so otherwise I'll just have to speed up the last episode uh, in order to make it fit because I think it will not be shorter but it might be a little bit longer but then it will not be longer than six episodes because I'll just speed up the last episode which is sort of logical I guess but um, yeah here you see something sort of strange happening already because we've got a pool uh, I just imagined like a really cool pool party at a nightclub I find you know in The Sims you can do anything and you can make anything look cool so I thought you know I'm just going to make a rooftop infinity pool and then uh, yeah make sort of a nightclub around it and then I come up with the idea of adding uh, the dance floor just around the water or the water around the dance floor actually and then uh, I came up with the idea to just bring the pool all the way throughout the entire building sort of or throughout the entire space all the way to the other side where I'll continue have another actual pool so people can or the sims can actually actually swim from the front to the back uh, which I thought was pretty cool and also here I'm a sort of yeah yeah stating the style of what the building will look like already because it will be very modern obviously you probably expected that already but um yeah i thought it would be cool to add these new objects those shutters which come with the sims for city living in this building as well i didn't actually intend to use those but then i added these pillars which you saw me add in the beginning and i yeah add them all over the place in this building uh but i realized hmm, i want to change something a little bit because only pillars doesn't really look that good and then i realized that we have these really cool new items coming with the sims for city living so i just added those and that really uh, really looks cool um, and in my opinion that really creates a very cool and realistic effect sort of it's just a realistic modern build sort of it's not even though it's on top of a skyscraper and you would 
probably never see this in real life it would actually be possible and the architecture is like sort of realistic which is often what i kind of want to go for something special and maybe a little bit strange but still it should be possible and you should be able to see this in real life um if you would ever like walk around or something that you would see this and you wouldn't think like this is fake it's actually possible but um yeah it's modern obviously i said that already and uh the the nice thing about actually having recorded a couple of parts of the let's build already is that i know what it will look like and i know already that it will look good because i've worked on it and uh the entire shape is done already and man that that really is going to look cool and i can't wait for you all to see it i'm going to do my best to get this uh, let's build up frequently uh so that you can just enjoy uh, every episode and i think we should be done in two weeks but i'm um, it's never i'm never sure about let's builds uh, because it's sort of hard to plan everything and make sure that everything goes right and i have time to record um, because with the last let's build the let's build a, a wellness center something went wrong in case you're still waiting for this series i'm very sorry to let you know that i will not continue that series and I really wanted to continue that series because that bull just really looked cool. And actually by now, when I think about it again, I really realized that it really sucks. But, um, but my PC uh, broke a couple of weeks back and I hadn't made a backup of the Sims file and I also hadn't uploaded it to the gallery yet. So that really sucks because therefore I don't have the file and I really was sort of far in the process already as you probably know if you followed the series. And it just takes way too much time to uh, rebuild everything. So unless one of you is able to rebuild it exactly the way it was, which probably no one will do, I will not be able to continue working on that let's build. So I'm sorry for that. I'm, I'll make sure that it won't happen with this let's build because I think I'll back it up m m like more frequently or I just secretly hope that it will just not happen because I'll probably forget backing it up. But um, yeah, it really sucks. I'm sorry. But um, yeah, I, yeah, I hate it as well. But you know, we've got a new let's build now and it's with the Simpson City living. So it's something new, something different and uh, maybe even cooler than uh, the last let's build even though i must say that that building really was starting to look pretty cool so it sort of sucks but um yeah as you can see this is a let's build it is sped up but not too much so that you can still sort of see uh what i'm doing what the process is like because that's sort of important with a let's build in my opinion uh, here i'm sort of creating an open area i thought it would be cool because there will be glass all around there i'm not sure if you'll see that in this episode already but um then you have got this open area on the lower level you've got a dance floor and then people from above can actually look onto the dance floor which is what you would normally see in nightclubs as well of course so i thought that just added sort of a cool effect and I've never actually done it like this before. At least I normally don't really think about the interior yet when I'm building the exterior. But this time I did and I already came up with this idea. And also was able to sort of change the exterior in such a way or just build the exterior. I didn't even have to change it because it was the first time I bought it. But um, yeah, I could just adjust the uh, exterior to make it fit with the interior which is sort of good because normally I have to really adjust the interior in order to make it fit within the like the shell which I built for the exterior because I never change anything uh, when I finish the exterior because it just looks good and if I change anything the whole building is sort of being destroyed but if you sort of combine those two things working on the interior and the exterior uh, or keep the interior in mind you just really create a much better building so um, I thought it would be good for this one. It's a nightclub, like I said, but there will also be very many bars and maybe a restaurant as well. I'm not too sure yet. Maybe at some level I can add a restaurant, but um, yeah, it's just really cool with that infinity pool looking over the city. Uh, I can't wait to like make an overview video of this already at the end of the series after the six episodes and then show you what it looks like when you look over the city from the from the pool but yeah this is the end of the first episode already i hope you enjoyed watching it i hope you'll enjoy the next five episodes as well stay tuned for those and then yeah i thank you for watching this and i hope to see you back later